Tyler Larkin, 126 pound national champion. How are you feeling? I feel good. I think I rushed great this tournament. Still got Greco, but I feel amazing. I feel really good. What were you thinking uh, coming into the tournament? Uh, did you think you could win? What were your goals for this tournament? I knew I was going to win. I, I already knew I was going to win. I, I just I just wanted some respect. Like I haven't got my respect yet. I, I better get it after this one, but I know I know how good I am. I just want everyone else to know. You had a really crowded and interesting semifinal match. Talk a little bit about that. I was I was ready to wrestle that match. Um, I thought that my teammate Adrian Mazur, he just won. Uh, I thought he was gonna get to wrestle with Gibson. I thought it was gonna be a good match, but I got it. I feel like I wrestled great. He's a really good kid, he's a tough opponent. It was fun. What impact, what impact does your father have on your wrestling? I mean, he he knows he knows a lot. He knows how to how to do it. He doesn't put too much pressure on me. I, I I never feel pressured. I feel I feel excited. I feel good, and I just I just know how good he is. I know how good I can be, and yeah. How much do you know about what he was? <laughs> I know a lot, but I'm sure I don't know everything. It's always something that you don't know. Talk about wrestling on the big stage. Compare that to anything else you've experienced in the sport. I mean, I've always, I've always wanted to wrestle on something like that. It seemed like when I, when I was younger, me and my brothers, we'd be, we'd be like really young. We'd say blah blah blah. Like we just make stuff up in our heads, and we'd be like, "This is Fargo Finals." Like we just mess around. Here I am, and I'm, I'm doing it. I'm winning it. It's crazy, you know. It's fun. I'm just thankful. You talked a little bit about um, your training situation and Adrian, and maybe share a little bit more about what that means to you. I mean, it's it's awesome having me and him. We know each other for a while. He's been my training partner for forever, and we're we're doing big things. We're accomplishing big goals together. It's amazing to have the person you've been doing it with right there next to you. Feels great. It's awesome. So, could you say, um, you know, tell the country, you know, a lot of people don't know about Valiant Prep. Tell, tell people what's going on down there at Valiant Prep. Big things. I mean, we're coming. So, remember, Valiant's gonna get you. Emilio Escuri, he's got high hopes for him. I think he's gonna get it in juniors. I think he's gonna take it, Valiant. Tell me about uh, how. How your father has, um, he, he's done a great job at bringing in other coaches and mentors and handing you off to them, right? And, right? and dealing with you in a certain way. Can you explain to me how important that's been to your development? We're always trying to learn from everybody that we can. We're just trying to, we've traveled all over just for training, just to get better, just to gain new things. And I think, I think we're doing the right thing. Congratulations. Thank you. You know, national champion. Um, Greco, uh, are you moving up and waiting, Greco? We'll see. We'll, we'll see. I kind of I kind of thought you might. That's why I asked. Um, you know, I know it's it's a it's a long weekend, and you know you had to hold your weight for this. So, you know, a lot of, a lot of kids decide to go up. Yeah, I mean, I might. It was it was good cut for me to get down here, but we'll see. Okay. Well, congratulations. Thank you.